Did you know that over 80 million bacteria can be exchanged in a single kiss? Yeah, that's almost as gross as my head being in this jar. Make sure you guys stay tuned towards the end of the video because I'm going to be sharing with you my next paranormal black activity trailer. My Arabia Mountain nighttime investigation. I've been hinting at it for the last couple of videos. This is a banger. You're not going to want to miss it. What's going on guys? It's your girl Amber Smiles Jones and welcome to the Professionally Silly channel. So today we got ourselves another wonderful Halloweenish type of video and honestly this video wouldn't be happening if it wasn't for one of you. So this video goes out to Sandra G. I'm not going to say her full name because she may not like that. I don't know her life. She could be running from the law as far as we know. But Sandra hooked me up with some cash so that I could purchase the Walking Dead Saints and Sinners game. For those of you who don't know, The Walking Dead is a zombie TV show and it is amazeballs. I think there's like 11 or 12 seasons of it and I love it. Team Michonne, what's up? I'm not just saying that because I'm black and I have dreads. She's just a dope ass character. I'm really excited about this video, so make sure you guys go ahead, click the thumbs up button, and make sure you subscribe. We're gonna have ourselves an Oculus Quest 2 Walking Dead Saints and Sinners gameplay right here, right now. Thank you, Sandra. Or is it Sandra? Sandra? Sandra. Sandra. Sadra. Nope. Thank you though. <laughs> also guys, don't forget, I live in a house full of people, so you're going to hear some random ass sounds around the place. Try to ignore that and focus your attention on me and all of my fear. All right guys, I hope this thing is recording. I think it is. Okay, let's find the game. Let's see what we got. All right. That looks pretty cool. The Walking Dead, Saints, and Sienos. I think it is loading. Isn't responding. Let's see if we can figure this out. Look at this place though. I know you guys can probably hear my mom laughing. She's having the best conversation right now. Look at that. It's like we're in future in the future. We got flying cars and shit. <laughs> Look at that little ball over there. That's cool. I got my own little screen and stuff over here. Looks like you can touch it. <laughs> yeah, like stairs leading upstairs. Okay, okay. Old school computer over there. All these cool posters. Good ventilation system. Look at the monorail. Okay, alright. Alright, let's get to the game here. Let's... Oh, it's working. Alright. I'm scared. Oh, I'm already. I'm already outside, bruh. <laughs> Birds. This is weird. This is wily. It's garbage everywhere. And this twisted survival game of survival. Okay, kill the blah. Got it. Okay. This mode is for players already familiar with, with the combat. Oh shit. We need to go back. Because I'm not familiar. <laughs> I'm ready. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, I'm gonna be her. Arm selection. Oh, you can choose your arms. I don't see the difference. I like B better though. <laughs> Skin tone, I'm black. Why not? <laughs> hey Chris, are you in here? No, he's not. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I am actually kind of scared right now because I, zombies, like, you're, I'm immersing myself in the game. It's, it's like I'm actually physically there. I can see my black hands and my watch and shit. What's that, Taco Bell? What's that? It's a bell. I got my knife right here. So I think right now I was trying to teach me what to do. Reach down to your left hip and grab the small weapon in your holster. Okay. Oh, and then I could be like, mm, stab. Just stabbing motherfuckers. Okay, what happened to the letter? Oh, I got it. Alright. Oh, I got a gun? That's what's up. Grab that. 
and you shoot that way. Okay. So now I've got my my axe. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, I can grab it twice. Mmm. Killing them. Just killed my first zombie. <clears throat> Weapons will break. Durability meter. Ah. Grab axe and walk and kill them. I can do that. Okay, let's kill the next one. Yo, this game is hard, bro. And this is just a training fan. Pistol. Don't mind if I do. Fire the pistol. All right. Oh, I just loaded this weapon. Oh, I was about to shoot you. <laughs> you almost got shot. get that in open sword. Do I need this? Why won't you let me grab that bag? <laughs> it's getting dark. Ooh. And this is, the motion is making me feel like I'm moving and shit. It's kind of disorienting. Why are you, is that money? So now we're back in the water. Can I grab this bag now? Nope. Guess not. 
Look at all these dead bodies in the water, bro. Oh shit, they're alive dead. I mean, zombies. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. the game even started. Like I dropped the gun and I panicked. I <laughs> ran out of bullets. <laughs> this, this boy, this gets your heart going y'all. I'm telling you. Oh shit. And the sound in the headset is really good. It's like, it's really immersive. It's like you're there. Whew. Oh, we're good. Be honest with y'all. I feel like this is the video right here. I'm I don't know if I can handle any more of this shit. I don't forgot everything I learned in training. I'm gonna be murdered immediately. All right, so we're on day one, late evening. <sighs> okay. There's bodies. Okay. Ooh, Chris. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. To the right. To the right. Oh my God. I don't even know where to go. I guess not that. Oh, look at that moon. It's That's pretty. so pretty, right? The stars. Oh, the stars look real too. Right? Can I pick up these bricks? Huh. Oh, you're crouched. Oh, so you really got a crouch? Huh. Graveyard. Start. Task added, add, added to journal. Okay. Find the old man's hideout. An old man named Henry lives in this graveyard. Told me to meet him here. If I help him, Find the reserve, he'll split the supplies with me. Okay. Let's see if we can find him. Do I have weapons? I am unarmed. Woo! That was loud. Okay. I need a weapon, bro. This is not going to end well for me. At all. Okay, y'all, if I crouch, okay, there's a dead zombie dude over there, bro. Look at my watch, it's fire. Okay, okay, wait. Oh, okay, I can grab that knife out of his head. He dead. Get, get it to me. going over here. Grab on top of the flat surface and push down. Sir, <clears throat> and push down. <clears throat> Charming. Jump over. Okay. I did. Woo! There's a zombie person. Y'all see it? There's a zombie, uh, zombie man. I'm about to die, y'all. I already know, bro. Look, let me just... Okay. He... Bro, this is where I die. Y'all know it. Y'all know it. about to die. You better stay dead and stop playing games. Got my knife. Hold up. Kill me another one. I think I got bit though. 
Boy, I tell you, my, my heart rate, it, it, it is, it is everywhere. Bruh. But them stars, though. Look at them stars. Okay. Hold on, who's behind me? What's going on? Look at that moon. Okay, all right, look. Okay. More dead bodies. Excuse me. Wait, 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 wait. Don't, don't. Don't shut too hard. You did? Y'all did? Y'all did, right? Okay. Oh! Look at him hanging. I bet you he ain't dead. You did? Look, I just to make sure everybody's gone already because I don't need them coming up. Get you down, sir. The rest. Drown. Drown. Oh, language? So long. Waterfall. Waterfall. What are you talking about, bruh? Are you dead? Because if I got to stab you, I have no problem doing that, sir. No problem at all. Should I cut you down? Like, what? Are you. Oh, you're dead. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm just going to. Stab you in your head. Okay. You don't deserve to be a zombie. Okay. I hope you go to a better place, sir. It's a pleasure killing you. Okay. Let's... Oh, let's crouch. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Whoop! Music done started something up. Music done started. What's up? Woo! What? What? Oh, okay. Task complete. What's this? Yeah. This looks sharp. Oh. Is it like a, what do I do with it? I can stab bitches with it? Hey, wait, no. I can use both of these. Oh, wait, hold on, I got it. So where I go on the bus? I need it. Okay. This game is wild. Hey, y'all, where's the camera? Is your record? Okay, so I slept. I stole shit. What's this? You never know. All right. Can y'all hear that? Okay. I'm 
sure I'll die soon. Don't you guys worry about that. I have to eat some food. Got some medication. You're definitely gonna need that. All right. I've killed several walkers so far because I'm on my shit. Hold on. Where's my, damn it. Where are my weapons at, bruh? Well, this is where I die because I ain't got no weapons. I don't even got a gun. Ain't that some shit? I thought I stole a bunch of stuff from the bus. Apparently, I did not. So, I'm looking for shit I can use as a weapon. I don't see nothing. Wait, hold on. Anything over here? What is this? Box of stuff. You may have to stop, you little shit. I can hear you. I can't get in the water. Damn, where are the weapons? Oh, there y'all are. Okay, guys, so that's gonna be it for this game, for this video. I was able to get pretty far. I killed a couple of zombies. I didn't die. Okay, so I don't know how much of the video you were able to see. Y'all know me, I don't have all the perfect hardware that all of these uh, big YouTube channels have, so I always gotta find a way to rig things up. But the Walking Dead Saints and Sinners game is a lot of fun. There are a few things I would change, you know, cause working the controllers, you really gotta remember which buttons to press and which ones not to. And it's, I mean, I guess it's for any game, but it just seems more difficult because of the controllers and how they set up this particular game. But it was fun. I am still kind of, my heart, rate is still up my blood pressure is skyrocketed to the roof because the game is so immersive you feel like you're there it is insane do i recommend walking dead saints and sinners yes i do but be prepared to play for a long time so make sure you hydrate and pay attention and training because it's super super important clearly i am still in the spirits of halloween as you saw with the random fact at the beginning of this video so i thought we would continue the fun not to mention you already know what time it is it's time to go ahead take a look at your feature comments from one of my past videos and the video we're going to be looking at is the i found money using randonautica and I did, technically. Shoot, go check it out, you see what I mean? It was a fun episode. We need to make more Randonautica videos because I have so much fun with that app. I also heard there's a geo-coaching or geo-tagging or some other uh, app that I've been wanting to look into as well. Yeah, here it is, geo-coaching. So maybe we'll do something with that once I figure out what it is. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get into these comments. Well, first comment is coming from Krista Star. I told you we were gonna have some fun with this, didn't I? <laughs> Krista Star says, subscribe today because I love your vibe. Well, I appreciate you, Krista Star. I'm enjoying your vibe as well. Let me ask you this. How are you feeling about my vibe currently? Is this weird? Yeah, probably. Our next comment is coming from She Murray or Shay Murray. Y'all know I don't do names well. <laughs> But Shay says, cool vibes. Yeah, a new subscriber. Vibe check. I mean, two people have already said that they enjoy my vibe. My vibe is immaculate. Yes. Also, thank you for the comment. <laughs> Our next comment is coming for... Oh, that? Oh, that. It's just a knife to the head. It's fine. I'm fine. Our next comment is coming from Title Leaf. Title Leaf says, super video. I applauded for $10. Title Leaf, I noticed that and I want to thank you right now. I appreciate you. And first of all, and I'm glad that you enjoyed yourself. I know it's difficult to listen to me and take me seriously with this knife protruding out of my skull. But I mean what I say, man. I appreciate you. 
I have to say, reading comments using TikTok filters is a lot of fun. I should probably do that more in the future every now and then, you know? Just like have some fun with TikTok filters. You know, you should really follow me on TikTok. We have fun there, we have fun. So many of you may be wondering, what was Tidal Leaf talking about when dealing with applause? Apparently YouTube now has this thing where if you really enjoy a video that a creator brings to you, that you can tip them, you can applaud them cash money. So underneath the video in the same area where you would click the thumbs up button or you would share something or download the video, there's a little heart there that has a dollar sign inside of it and it says applause or thanks or something like that. So what that does is that it allows you to tip your favorite YouTuber. So Title Leaf, I appreciate that. And I also think a few of my other subscribers have done so as well. And I really appreciate you guys because it, it takes money to make these videos and it takes a lot of time. And for me to do it twice a week, every week and not miss, it's very rare that I don't put up a video or I don't put up a podcast and uh, I don't make much money on it. So it feels really, it feels really good that some of you enjoy my content enough to to donate to my channel so I can continue to bring you guys amazing content and even visit new locations and try new activities and all that kind of stuff. So shout out to all of you that are putting your money where your mouth is. I really appreciate it. It's very well needed. Subscribe, like, comment, share, all of those amazing things. You gotta click that thumbs up button. You know, let's, let's try something. Today is Halloween, all right? Let's see if we can get the numbers of views for this video to match the numbers of thumbs up buttons clicked. I, it seems impossible, but I don't, I don't think it is. I think we can do it. If you're still watching this video, do me a favor, click that thumbs up button. Let's see if we can make it happen, Captain. Podcast, I have one. Subscribe to it. The Professionally Silly Podcast. We have a lot of fun over there. This month on the Professionally Silly Podcast, we kept it creepy over there. We kept it creepy. Closing it off this past Friday with an episode of creepy little stories. And let me tell you something. It was some terrifying shit, especially the one about, about mother. Oh, listen, let's just say if you ever happen to see an old vintage creepy ass wooden chair sitting in the middle of your living room for no reason, there actually might be a reason. It just... It's probably a creepy one. True crime, paranormal experiences, and a lot of what the fuck type of episodes. We have a lot of fun there. So come chill with your audible boo thing on the Professionally Silly podcast. For those of you who are unaware, I have a second channel called Paranormal Blacktivity. And I put my black card on the line and I go and I investigate haunted locations and sometimes even haunted objects. There are not a lot of female black paranormal investigators out there, especially ones that are part of the letter community. So go ahead, support that channel by subscribing and checking out those videos. Do not let the view counts of my videos or the subscription count of, of, uh, of that channel deter you. It is a good channel. It is a lot of fun and nobody is making paranormal content quite like I do because it's still me, which means you're gonna have a mix between funny and what the fuck? It's great, you're gonna love it. This is the Paranormal Blacktivity trailer you've been waiting for. We went back to Arabian Mountain, but this time we went back at night. He's in the trees, he's just, he's just sitting there. Yeah. Are you scared of us? I feel like it's getting bigger. I don't know who they are or what their intentions are. Can you tell us where we are? We're at the bottom of what? Ooh. That's it, mountain. Did it not? Yeah. Did it not just say <laughs> mountain? Whoa, what the fuck was that? Was that y'all? These niggas is already gone. You done dropped your phone. Hey, what the fuck was that? I saw it, Amber. That Let's go. Hit me. Let's go. That shit Let's hit go. me. What the f Chris! Yo. Something just knocked the light off of my U-Vol! It's a um. Uh, no oh shit! Woo! dishwashing detergent, and fingernail clippers.